When we are young and meet with friends after a long time, we exchange pleasantries, we exchange our phone numbers. Fast forward a few years later, we start exchanging our cholesterol numbers, our blood pressure numbers, our blood sugar numbers. And that often becomes the topic of conversation. Hey, what's your cholesterol number? Hey, why is it so high? Hey, are you taking any statins? It's so low. What do you do? What are you doing? So today, let's decode cholesterol numbers. Let's talk about cholesterol. As a physician, three numbers are important to me. One is LDL, HDL, and triglycerides. What is LDL? LDL is the bad cholesterol. And it's bad because it gets deposited in the walls of the arteries, the heart arteries, brain arteries, and uh, that can potentially cause heart attacks, strokes, etc. LDL, what is the optimum number? It should be under 100, ideally. But if you have diabetes, if you have heart disease, we want the number to be under 70. And then comes HDL. HDL is the good cholesterol. Now, why is it good cholesterol? Because it sucks LDL out of the blood, sends it to liver where it's broken down. Higher the better. Ideally, around or above 60, but definitely above 40. Between 60 and 90 is when it helps the most. We don't know what happens when LDL is super high, like over 90. Some studies show that it's actually bad if even HDL is too high. But in my clinical practice, mostly what I see is low HDL rather than super high HDL. Then comes triglycerides. Triglycerides is another form of fat in the blood. And this fat comes from excess calories. When you take in more calories than you're able to burn, that gets converted into triglycerides, especially if it's a carbohydrate high diet. And that fat, triglycerides, is then stored in the liver. Ideally, the number should be under 150. So that's all about LDL, HDL, and triglycerides. Now, heart disease isn't just about cholesterol, isn't just about these numbers which is why we do something called Advanced Lipid Panel. If you want to know more about Advanced Lipid Panel, put in the comment section below and we'll talk about that sometime.